figured it was a music pack and I have a harmonica, so I figured why not play everyone a ditty. Please use that in your YouTube videos if you so wish, and you don't even have to credit me for it, because I suck at playing the harmonica. Hey everybody, Colorful Artie's back for more of Lemmings World Tour. Praise be to God on this glorious day. We only have 10 professional levels left. Let's try knocking that number in half this video, shall we? We're on level 31. Bay of Pigs. That's definitely a Cuban level if I've ever heard of one. This is by Civil War. <laughs> We've got 60 lemons, we can kill two of them. Wow, we are just getting a bunch of the different location levels as of recently, I'm noticing. So we got a hatch to the left, and then a hatch on a boat that is both climbers and swimmers. Interesting. Oh. Are those zombies? Those are zombies! Climber and Swimmer Zombie- Oh, this just got tough. Okay, well, um... So we're gonna have to find a way to kill all of the zombies before trying to get away across. Alright, I think I see a way. So if we do that... We can only kill one more lemming, which is not great. Oh! I'll turn around. That's very interesting. If we do this, all the zombies are going to get stuck. Okay, so that's all the lemmings we can afford to lose. So now we're going to max out the release rate and make the last lemming out on our side a glider. Okay, so all the zombies are now stuck in the water and they're making an annoying noise. So that's what Christmas is all about, Charlie Brown. So unless I'm mistaken, the rest of the level should be relatively simple. One, two, three, four, five. Do this, and now we should hopefully be able to platform across here back to the start. We have ten platformers, so I would hope so. Ah, beautiful. What's not beautiful is the sound of a thousand zombies heading this way. Nope, that didn't work. I was trying to do the victory tune on the harmonica, but I'm not skilled enough with the harmonica to be able to do that. We're on level 32. Brat... okay. Bratislava Lover. This is by Basta. Basta? Basta. I don't know. Gotta save everyone. This is another really nice looking building level. Holy cow! Oh, Strato. I don't think I can even release Art Lems now, because my levels are going to look like crap in comparison to this. That looks so nice! I think those are blocks from the Egyptian... No, those are from Ihotolat's Dune tile set, I believe. We got the Highland tile set. That also seems to be from the Doom tile set. We got the brick. Wix tile set, the city tile set. Oh my gosh. That's really pretty. Uh, it's really pretty. We also have very few skills. So they're all nice and safe. They're all nice and safe, and that's it. Okay. We'll need most of our builders for the end. We're going to need three builders, I'd estimate, for the end there. A lot of this is just walking in Memphis. Yeah, this... this might not be that bad. I believe we will need our miner for this part. And unless I'm mistaken, I think we're gonna build over the tunnel? 
yeah, do like a dolly dimple thing around the tunnel. Not good. Well, all I can say is I really, really hope we only need two builders for that end part. Let's find out, shall we? How many builders do we need for that end part? Well, we also can destroy the terrain near the end. So yeah, that's not enough, but what we can do is this. And that is enough. Now the question is, can we get these can we get this lot out into build or two bashers? I don't think we can. Hmm. What could the glider be used to help us out with? I mean, we could use the glider for there, but that's still going to take two builders. Oh! Okay. What we're going to need is a way to hold the lemmings back without using a builder. If we don't have a builder, we it stands to reason we'll need a basher. So this is actually going to be really clever. So first off, will he walk out of the tunnel? He will. Okay. This is actually really, really clever. Holy cow. So we're going to mine through here. This guy's going to go ahead. While they're mining, he's going to glide. Actually, he's going to glide from higher up than that. So that way he can get a nice boost. And he'll be able... Oh, man. Oh, but that's such a good idea. I want to make this work. <laughs> I sound like I'm talking to, like, my girlfriend or something. My imaginary girlfriend. If we make him dash, will that hold him back enough? No, it won't. Hmm. I really want to make this work, but I'm not sure if I can. But if we do that, we'll have a builder to spare for here, which will be very nice. Just trying to figure out a way to use a better idea. Duh, we'll just mine from back here. And then we can bash. Duh. I was going to do some crazy release rate shenanigans. Which sounds like a great name for a level. For somebody who's actually going to make a Lemmings pack <laughs> and release it, you are allowed to use the level title Flow Control Shenanigans. I will not be upset if you don't credit. Well, I mean, it would be great if you could credit me for that, but I mean not necessary. I'll just be happy to play it. Oh, this was a fun level. That, that beginning part really made it. And I mean, I know that's pretty much the, where the bulk of the solution lies. But that was a really cool and clever beginning part. Yippee, yippee, yippee. And now everyone can go to the exit. I'm going to play a little ditty on my harmonica every time I beat a level now as well. We're on level 33, Aquarius. It's the Age of Aquarius by Hair Musical. We can kill five lemmings on this level. And we got a lot of different flags from a lot of different places in the world. And the only one I recognize is the Italian flag. Okay, I may have taken the term lemmings migration a bit too literally. <laughs> That's funny right there. Okay. 
So what are we up against? We have got an exit there. Oh, well. I see, so it's a button level. Wait, maybe? Wait, that's not a locked exit, is it? There's a button there. Oh, no. Why? I don't think... I can't tell if that's a locked exit or not. I'm going to assume it is a locked exit and we do have to hit all the buttons. I don't think you can make an exit that's unlocked. No, you can. You can make a, le a level with buttons with an unlocked exit. For example, that one doesn't look locked. Hmm. Alright, well, let's try some stuff. First of all, we need to hold these guys back. Like, we need to hold them back real good, like... If at all possible. Well, we got ten platformers, so... Cool. And just like that, they're pinned in. Now then... Oh, that's its own decoration, is it? Okay. So if we do that... Everyone's hunky dory on this side. However, it would help to be able to platform across the top. Oh, we're gonna run out of platformers on this level, ain't we? We're gonna need so many platformers. If I can avoid having to use platformers, I'm going to try to. Mmm. How many bastards are we even going to need? We're going to need one to get through here, possibly two. We'll need one to get through there. Oh, we actually don't need that many bastards. Okay. So... Let's not clone him just yet. We'll come back for that later. I'm going to platform from such a place that he can still climb up the building from that side. Then I'm going to use another builder here, so he'll be able to hit the button on the way back. Two platformers to get across there. Now I'm going to clone him. We can afford to kill him. <laughs> Love that sound effect. Wait, no, no, no! Shoot, I just realized. Oh, I better hit that button fast. Mm. That sucks. Okay, well, I've done the left side of the level. So I can use the two batteries over here. If I can let them out, I can let a guy go to this way. I think I'm going to run out of platformers. That's going to take four platformers there. I only have three left. That's going to take... Oh, no. 
know. I think I'm doing this completely wrong. So they're all pinned in. So this is the side I have to worry about right from the off. We can afford to kill five lemmings. And we have a cloner. So why don't we why don't we just let some of them drown? I sound like a psychopath saying that. But it's true. We can let some of them drown. And now they're all pinned in. Cool. That took all of our builders, but I'm I'm proud of the work we did. So now, what actually might be smart is if we crank up that release rate, we can have the last lemming out bash through here. Or actually, a better idea might be to mine through here. Well, both. Well, maybe not both. I'm trying. Hang on, I'm get. Please excuse me. I'm getting a phone call. Okay, we are back. Sorry about that, everybody. So as I was thinking, trying to basically figure out. Okay, so let's just try bashing through. Save our miners if we at all can. We still have all ten of our platformers. Okay, we can get across there in two. So now they're trapped over here, but they can mine and bash everyone else out. So we're going to send up our climber now over this way. Without the builder, this part might be a little trickier, though. Just realized. Well, let's try. It's all we can do, right? I don't like doing that, though. <sighs> that Dane pole is in the way. Oh, it still has to climb over it. Stupid. Actually, wait. No. Hang on. Because we're going to bash them all out that way anyways, we can use our last bash here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This sucks. Why is it like the flags look like they're made from the exact same material as this, but this is solid and the flags aren't? I don't appreciate that. Save a platformer over here. Let's see where a platformer would take us over here. Not far enough. This will, though. We can mine through this now instead of bashing, eh? Ugh. 
builders are more precious than anything else. Get wow, that takes forever to rewind, even once. Alright. We've done that. I don't want to have to use a minor plus a dig uh, basher, but... I Actually, we can do that if we use two platformers. Beautiful. That'll actually help because I believe we used multiple builders on the other side. Unless something else un untoward comes up. <laughs> and the irony of the century we mined from too high up. There we go, beautiful. Now they can all get back up. And we still have two builders. Alright. Now I can actually do this without feeling guilty. Hmm, but they still have to climb up. That's not good. Do we need bashers for anything else? It doesn't appear we do. So let's do this. So he'll get stuck there. Whatever. You go to the exit and that's what really matters. Alright. Which means with our last breath... Alright, unless I'm mistaken, I believe we did it. That was a tricky level. And the fact that you have to unlock the door is... I mean, I actually didn't really add a whole lot of difficulty now, did it? And just like that... <laughs> On to the next level! Woohoo! That was a fun one. Level 34! <laughs> Bane of Boomerang by ABBA. Okay, this one looks really cool. I love the Egyptian pyramid on the left-hand side. That winding bridge. Oh, this looks good. We can kill free lemmings. I wonder which free we're killing. Okay, so they can walk all across this except for that top part. Which, by the way, looks sweet. Got this high-tech bridge. We're gonna need a builder there. I feel like the bridge is really balm for what we're doing. This end part. Oh, wow. How are we gonna do this? I think I know how. Alright. Well, let's keep him. I don't want to make the blocker who's not going to move that. So he's going to climb up there. Oh, getting the move. That's good. Well, no, we got the miner. Which may or may not factor into my plans. So everyone could get on this bridge. Now, if it's as simple, wait, if it's as simple as I'm hoping, 
This will be great. But I don't think it will be. Alright, cool. That's where we want to be. Now I gotta ask, how many pixels up is that? One, two, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I think they can get up that without climbing. Booyah. We're going to do an imposing block kind of thing, and hopefully this will get them low down enough. Uh, that's uh, awful. I was hoping we could blow two holes clean through these and use two builders to get up there. But perhaps that was too much to ask. We may end up needing the blocker for the end. Yeah, I'm guessing we're needing the blocker for the end and the miner. So instead, what we're going to do is bomb to keep them from going back. we can blow them up across the whole thing. Oh, we can. It's just wide enough. Okay, that makes it easier. That's cool. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. We'll let the first guy go up. Second guy is going to blow up. Okay, that makes sense. Saving the miner for the end is a much better idea. I'm like, I bet we could get up there with two digger bombers. No, we can't. Oh, problem. Oh, problem. There's trouble on planet. Wait your turn. Oh, I hope this works. Oh, I really hope this works. If we do this... Can we have someone blow up in this tunnel? We can! Good to know. Still gonna suck because we still have to get them over here. Also, I don't really. Mm. All right. Well, you know what? Nothing's gonna get done if we keep moping about it. I, I don't wanna turn into Telly from Sesame Street here, but I'm worried we're not going to be able to finish <laughs> with these skills remaining. Mainly because I need the two climbers to be spaced back enough so that one can block the other when the first one starts mining. one, make no mistake about it. Yeah, 
Yeah, if only there was some way to keep him in the tunnel. We'll get him farther back. Actually, there is a way to get them farther back. It requires... Not sending the second climber right away. What if we sent the second climber right now? I hope it's good enough. Might have been too much. That is actually too much. Okay, so we actually need to make a mine from lower down. Oh my gosh, this might work out just perfectly. Or maybe it won't because, oh no. So we'd have to save him. And that is so not happening. Oh, freak, no! Where did I go wrong? I wonder. Okay, I'm just gonna preface this by saying if this works, this is really stupid. That works. Now, granted, too many are gonna fall off the cliff and die. If we do that, we don't even need to hold them back, do we? <laughs> but all that does is save a builder. Or not a builder, a digger. This is a really tough level. That bridge is also, like, ridiculously long. <sighs> Hello, darkness, my old friend. I can literally hear the ghost of my harmonica in my head as I'm playing this. Oh, we need a way to turn him around somehow, but that requires a second digger. That requires a second digger. Or a bomber. Both work. Actually, a bomber would not work. Digger would work. Builder would also work. However, there's no way we can do that. We need a builder to get up there. And we're going to need a builder to get up the zigzag. Builders are out, so we have to find a way to spare the deer. Only way we can do that, I imagine, is by doing this, but then we can't get them across without letting too many die. I really want to believe I was doing it correctly. The first time. They still need the Digger Bomber to get through that. But as far as making this impassable for the Climber... I just don't see any way. So we can do that, send the second Climber and block, but... He's lost. I don't want him to be 
lost. This is the first level that's well and truly stumping me, actually. I can't see any other way through, though. Unless we do something like this. Actually, if we could do that... be able to make that work. Need to make the second one I mean, a blocker sooner, though. Like, let's make him a foot climber right there. too many builders now. We have the digger to spare, but I can't see how that would really help all that much. So we can build up here. We build up there, but we'll need a third builder there, and we need to turn people around. What am I missing? Can I spare a bomber somehow? That'll be lovely. But I don't think that that's really possible. Holding knife. I can't really rule out where any one thing is supposed to go. I pretty much guarantee the minor plus blocker is supposed to be used here. But... I will need a way to turn the lemming around to do that. Just as I've come. Just by doing this. See, here's the thing. If I had a bomber to spare, if I didn't blow up a lemming in the past, I could blow him up here and then they could just build to the exit. Or heck, I could even just let him die and then they could go to the exit. But there's no way I can spare the bomber there. And I'm pretty sure I can't spare the bomber there because too many lemmings turn around and they would have walked off the cliff otherwise. This is a huge problem. Hmm.
holy cow, this level is insane. Either that or I'm missing something really obvious. I'm gonna save that as a solution. I'm gonna save that replay because this is the closest that I've gotten. does seem like a good solution. I can't see any way of sparing a single destructive skill. What am I missing? We can't let the stupid climber die. That is definitely Splatterite. I need him to turn around. What's freaking what? need another climber. More than anything else, I need free climbers. Okay, well, hang on. I have an idea. But here's the... Okay. I'm gonna get the two as close together as possible. Do this. Blow them up like normal. Let's get them as close together as we possibly can. Okay, my idea. If we dig here, we can build over the exit. I think we could build over the exit, then block and bomb. Or do something like that. Because if we can do that, we don't need to turn him around. Minor physics refuse to let you actually mine through the tunnel. It's like, oh no, you made a gap. You can't do that. You suck. Mm -hmm. I'm on the right track now. I feel it. The dang thing's so high. Is there any possible way? For example, if I get right up on this. Alright, back. Wonder if there's a position I can dig from. So I can mine through the wall. Yes, there it is. And I'm, okay, I can't tell even with true physics mode if that's. No, they won't fall into that. How about. 
one behind that. That's, I believe, exactly what I did last time. Don't be like this game. Please, please, don't be like this. It's gonna be exactly like that. You suck. Let's keep it consistent, people. Yeah, he doesn't walk down into the exit even. That's so It's gonna say stupid, but actually it's not. Can we delay it anymore? Please? This be the place they've been seeking? Well, that's not nearly enough to mine through. We're gonna need two builders for that. Plus a third builder to actually get up. Oh my gosh. Why does everything have to be so difficult? And I really... I'm gonna try a few more things, and if I can't solve this, I can't solve this. I'm moving on to the next one. Got a schedule to keep. If I get super stumped on a level, I will find the solution off camera and then come back and show the solution off in a future video. Mm. It'll be so great. If we could just not have to worry about. too many. <sighs> this is so bad. I'm almost wondering if I should try going back to my original idea of the two bombers. If this was literally one pixel thinner, I think that would work. Also, is there a reason this is such a giant bridge? I could get a second digger or a single bomber up here, I could beat the level. Or even a third climber. But I freaking can't. I literally can't see any solution to this level. It really feels like I am one skill short.
wait a freaking second. Ah, no. Fought that bomber. Whoa, oh, hang on. I'm not gonna stop that easy. Torturing me. Okay, why is that enough to boil them through on this side, but not on that side? I don't understand the physics behind this game. I don't think this is even gonna work. Yeah, because I can't get a second climber over now. And I don't think I can even hit my head, because by the time I hit my head, I'm too low down. Yeah, okay. How come it blows up there, but it didn't blow up when he was facing to the right on that exact same pixel? I just, I don't understand. I actually don't mind the Malm Bridge, to be perfectly honest. I just can't stand the fact that there seems to be no solution to this level. Either that or I'm just too dumb to find it. And the annoying thing is I feel like I see the, what you're supposed to do, you just have one skill not enough. Access violation at Baina Boomerang. That's cool. Well, okay. Let's try to find a hint in the title. Boomerang. Boomerang is in. Goes forward. Comes back. Or Boomerang is in. Yeah! It, I was making a Boomerang tunnel! What do you want from me? We want a better Boomerang tunnel. Well... We absolutely unequivocally need a builder there. No two ways about it. Builder must be used there, which means we have two left. If we make a boomerang, we're going to need a builder there, and we're going to need a builder there. No two ways about it. It's 
all of our builders are currently in use, so we can't use the third one to get up there and send the climber back up. Okay. Keep our digger, we could dig and then build, and that would block the lanes out. Alright. This truly is my final attempt. I don't know how far back to make the second climber. Farther back than that. Actually, I should probably talk my way through the solution. What I'm planning on doing, I'm just sending the first climber this way, sending the second climber after him. I'm planning on... What am I planning on doing? Planning on digging and mining and blocking and mining. He walks back across the bridge. Okay, yeah. So, I have... Yeah, I know what to do now. I had the solution right. It was literally just little intricacies that were wrong. It's too much. So we gotta send the climber later than that. Actually, no. Maybe we don't. We just won't dig as far. Actually, wait. That might not change a darn thing. Yeah, it's still too high. We're gonna send the climber out later. Okay, now that I can actually see what you're supposed to do, it's still frustrating because I have the general idea down, and it's just that I was doing it slightly not the right way that was making me constantly lose. That's frustrating, but this is not a bad level. I just literally tried every possible variation on the solution except for the correct one. Which, well, it's annoying. I don't think I'm alone in thinking that. And getting this to line up just perfectly, especially with such a, how long the bridge is, very not good. If you could make some, you could easily like have or even a third of the length of that bridge, and it would be better. What's keeping him? Where's the stupid second climber? There he is. What's keeping him? Oh, that was the second climber that I was digging? Oh. Again, I... Make the bridge shorter, please and thank you, Strato. Oh, freaking finally! So now what we get to do is we get to use the climber coming back to do this. Okay. I guess it's kind of clever, and I'm really glad I looked back at the name Bane of Boomerang, because it's a boomerang in two ways. You're making a boomerang shape with the minor tunnel, and you're also coming back to save the lemmings. This is still a very infuriating level and probably the most frustrating level I've played in the pack, though. And again, it literally just goes back to I tried every variation on the correct solution except the right one, and it took way longer than it should have.
Rip everyone using earphones. Oh, and I got an error on the next level. It's probably saying, hey. Oh, wow. That just, like, literally destroyed Neo Linux. Holy cow. Like, that completely destroyed the window for Neo Linux. It's, it's here. It's just a blank window. But I can't get rid of it. I'm actually having to break out Task Manager. Okay. So despite being... Right now, I'm literally at the 1 hour 15 minute recording for this video. I'm keeping up. I'm, I'm beating 5 levels. I'm beating 5 levels. We're on level 35, Iron Maiden. This just makes up for the week off that I took off. Eh? Tri this is by Trivium. 80 Lemons. Gotta save all 80 of them. Nice looking level. We got like half an igloo and we're going on ruins. Seems to be the common theme. Ruins, not half an igloo. Okay, ten platformers. That also seems to be a bit of a theme, eh? Hmm. And... Wait, how are we even going to do this? We only have plat... Wait, huh? How can we turn them around? You can't turn around bashers and platformers, can you? No. Can you turn around fencers with platformers? Can you stop them? No. Wait. How is this even possible to turn the first lemming around? Wait, what? Okay... This is weird, this is weird... So unless I'm mistaken... You're supposed to dig down to this pit? Turn them around that way... But how the heck are you supposed to get... Oh my goodness, this is... I shouldn't be playing the level since I'm not in a very good mood from the last level. But I'm doing it anyways because... I don't know. So the lines will go this way. Okay, cool. So they will eventually turn around. That's great. And they travel a long way to do so as well. That's also really great. Oh, don't... Darn it. Lemmings. That would also be a great name for a level. Come on, keep piling out. Wow, there's a freaking ton of them. Can we do... No, we can't. I was hoping we could platform across that. Oh, 
That's bull. You guys can totally get up that. That is bull. You can totally get up that. Um, dude. Want the build the digger to use the offensive this way. Duh. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. How the heck am I supposed to turn this stupid first lemming around? Because I can't even do that because then the lemon. I like the half igloo, it does look very nice. I don't like the look of the ending here either. Wait, what? How are we gonna do this? Okay, we're gonna need to all five fencers. For the end. So we actually can't use fencers at all. That actually does simplify. Oh my gosh, this is so easy! I'm such a doofus! <laughs> we just cancel one digger with another! Oh my, okay. That was 100% my fault right there. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh my word. Oh, I'm really sorry, Mr. I know. Alright. I actually feel really stupid and bad now. Okay, never mind. This is actually a pretty fun level. I can't believe it was that easy. I'm like, this is impossible. What the heck? That's like, Artie, it's, it's fair. Actually, to be fair, when I first learned that trick back in Pimo Lems, that level stumped me for days. I actually had to ask Ikiko to a lot for help on that one. Last fence? Yeah, last fence. Cool. Okay, that was actually a fun level. <laughs> Please ignore all of my ranting and raging at the beginning of this level, because that was just me being dumb. Sorry, Strato. That was actually a really fun level and really cool. Now, the second to last level, though. I mean, that was also like an interesting level, but I didn't like that. Alright. Thanks for watching, everybody. Sorry I got a little downhearted in this one. And let me know what you thought of the harmonica. If people like the harmonica, I might bring it back. If people were like, Artie, 
that sounded awful. You can't play the harmonica. It was out of tune. It was horrible to listen to. Please don't bring it back. You could say that or say something nicer than that. Like, be like, maybe give the harmonica a rest. I'll know what that means. <laughs> don't worry about hurting my feelings. I know I can't play the harmonica. I never took lessons. I literally just have a harmonica that I can blow into. And that is literally the full extent of my knowledge on the harmonica. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time. We'll finish off the professional rank, and hopefully we won't get as angry as we did in this video. I apologize again, but it sometimes happens when I get to a really frustrating level. And still note, Strato, that I'm still massively enjoying this pack, even if that one level was... <sighs> induced me pulling out my hair and aggravating me. So... Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless, and may the technical difficulties not return.